Hi guys, welcome back. This is December Daily, day two of 2019. Uh, I've had my family here this evening for hot chocolates. I did a hot chocolate bar and stocked it up with sprinkles and squirty cream and all sorts of the kids to just chuck a bit of this and a bit of that in. So have a nice evening. So yeah, please excuse my mat in the background. It is a bit of a mess. Um, it was not intended to be a craft mat. It's just ended up that way. <laughs> Um, so, yeah, as I say, we've had my family here tonight, and uh, we've done hot chocolates, it's been a work day today, so not much has gone on in the day, but I managed to go over to Morrison's to get all the bits that I needed for the hot chocolate bar. Here I am having a little play around with the photo placement. I sort of guess the size of the images that I print out, there's no sort of order to it, so I had to have a little play around with it to make everything fit. And then I had a few random photos just floating about and I was having a little play here to see if I liked placing them anywhere else. I didn't end up with this photo here. The photo that's on the bottom of this uh, hot chocolate menu card I did when my family was here. My sister and I did a little bit of our journals together and I stuck that in to show her that's how I was going to use that image and that size. So that was stuck in already but I did do that this evening as well. So I'm just gluing them down. I'm not used to this glue yet, so I do kind of sit and hold it for a minute just to make sure that everything is stuck down. I don't think I really need to, but because it's photo paper, it's obviously heavy, heavier duty paper. I might want to make sure it's stuck down to the edges. So I hope you're all doing okay. I hope everyone's getting getting on well with their Christmas shopping and getting, getting all organised. You can actually enjoy some of December. I spend most of my time just getting stressed and panicking at the last minute and I just I had to get organised so nowadays I have a lot more I can have a lot more fun at Christmas I can do like my junk journal and things without having to worry and panic about shopping and wrapping at the last minute and I've already done most of it already I've got them stuck on there. I'm just squashing them down again <laughs> to make sure they're all well and truly stuck. I didn't do any writing on this card. That's just all images and that's what's in there. So I'm going to play around again with the placement of these images. I like this one here. I'm just gluing it off screen. I'm going to put that on there of me and the kids. Snapchat have added some of their Christmas filters. I do like a bit of Snapchat filter at Christmas time. <laughs> I'm a bit sniffly today as well. Yeah, and these few images are the ones that are floating around, which I might end up adding at some point. I did struggle a little bit with this spread and the, the photos. I'm not sure why, but well, I'm happy with how it turned out in the end, but I did have a bit of a, a bit of a struggle because a lot of it's already decorated for me. I felt like I wasn't really doing enough. But anyhow, so I started writing this with this white gel pen, and the gel pen's rubbish. And about halfway through the writing, I try and go back and go over the writing to make it more vibrant, but it didn't work out. So I actually used the Posca uh, white pen in the end. And just went over all the writing and did some doodling around it. You'll see it right at the end. Um, my camera cut out at the point that I was doing that, so that's not that's not in this video. Yeah, you can see I'm kind of looking at it, thinking mm, that's not very white. It doesn't kind of stand out. So I'm going over it here, but up close, it just looked awful. So scrap that. <laughs> I'm doing my regular journaling here. Which is what I stuck this in for. It's just about the day, if it'll work, blah, blah, blah. So, yeah, I can't believe we're on day two of December already. It will fly by, won't it? It always does. Just as what it is, I guess. We've got a lot going on in 2020. We're a lot lined up to go on. I think it's going to be a bit of a stressful year, so I shall enjoy December to its fullest, knowing that the carnage will start as of January. I 
And it was really difficult to write on this page because of the page underneath being decorated and I had the coffee cup on there and so I'm really having to hold the paper down in different places just to kind of keep it like here I'm keeping it flat because I don't want to scribble the writing and get it all bumpy and look messy and I've got the book propped up on the right hand side as well just to hold the page as flat as possible while I'm writing so I've got these bits of holly I thought the page just needed a little bit of I know, some movement, some texture. I like the light reflecting off these, so I just added this little bit of holly here. I had a bit of trouble with my glue as well. This is the uh, Tim Holtz Multi Matte Medium, and I was going to use these tweezers for the holly, but instead I ended up just dipping them in the glue and sticking the holly down with my fingers. This is really good glue. There's a lot of movement, so when you're initially putting it down, you can really play around with the placement before it sets. But once it's set, it is set. So it's good. It's not ideal for things like this, I have to say, because it's matte. So if you get any glue on the surface, it can obviously show up. But I did try and look for this Kiki K pen that you can see just to the left uh, for my last video to link it, but it's not available. I did buy it last year. And they don't even have anything really Christmasy. Oh, they actually tell a lie, they do have a candy cane one, which I quite like. But that was, I think that's a £12 one, so I think that's one of their refillable gel pens. This is their everyday gel pen, it was like two, two or three pounds. I stuck some washi on here, the candy cane washi, because I thought that was rather fitting with the hot chocolate. And here I'm going to do a little flip through so you can see. So here you can see that I've done the white pen and I've done some doodling. It's much better than that, that gel pen that I started with. And here's the tag with the photos. I like how that turned out. So thanks for watching. I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye.